Hey guys, so welcome back to my makeup channel. So today I did this electric kind of like a blue eyeshadow and I've only used the LA Girl Pro Artistry eyeshadow palette here. You can find this at Target or at CVS Longs here in Hawaii. And this palette is like so pretty. I don't know what it is, but it's super, super pretty. So this is the blue that I have on my lid and also have like some of the colors on my lid also. I much did this line also. This is a, from a pigment from MAC. So this is the pigment right here. This one is called Platinum, but I'll have everything listed down below for you guys to find out what kind of products I use to achieve this look. And I'm also wearing these new lashes and they are from Hawaii Lash Bar. And one of my good friends actually owns this company and I'll also link her website down below and I also have a discount code for you guys to use to get some percentage off. So definitely, definitely check her out because she has the most comfortable, I feel like they're very comfortable, long like lashes, like she has a bunch of them and also they're super lightweight on the eyes, they're not heavy or anything and so far I am loving it. And if you guys are interested in this one, this one is called Lemon Drop. So I'll link everything down below for you guys to find out and also my discount code if you guys are interested. And yeah, hope you guys really enjoyed this look. Please, if you guys are really interested of how I got this look, then keep on watching. Hey guys, so welcome back. So we're going to be using the MAC Prep and Prime 24 Hour Extended Eye Base. This is really good if you have oily lids like I do so I love prepping and using this as a base and I'm gonna be using my finger to warm the product onto my eyelids next I'm using my LA girl pro artistry palette and I'm going to be taking the color radiance and putting it onto my crease using a kind of like a blending brush and I'm just gonna be just basically blending it in and out uh, windshield wiper motion just to get it feathered out so I'm taking Savvy which is a light brown shade and I'm going to be placing this also into my crease where I have place a radiance with the same brush I'm taking finesse which is a little bit more darker than a savvy and I am putting that also into the crease with the same brush so using a light hand and also just blending it seamlessly and also just take your time blending 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 that's the only way you'll get these colors to blend taking a clean fluff brush and I'm just going to diffuse the edges that I have placed those colors. I'm taking this color called Graceful and this is going to be on my lid and this is what makes this blue so unique and I don't even have anything like this and I'm using this color on a short shader brush because I do have really small lids so I like using packing motions to add this color. I'm taking the color Champion which is like a rusty orange color and I'm using the same brush that I applied Savvy and Radiance. This is going to be above my crease so that way there's like a gradient effect. I'm 
using the color Sleek and this is a matte black and this is going to be on the corners of my eyes. So I just like to blend it in a V shape. That way it kind of looks like a cat eye in a way. And then also just blending it all over, just all in that area. Max Pigment in Platinum and Fix Plus and I'm going to mix it onto a mixing plate. I'm using this as a liner so I'm gonna be using an angle brush to apply it and yeah that's pretty much it you guys just line your lid. Touch me, touch me, touch. So moving on to face, I am using Max Time Check Lotion. So this is a primer and I'm placing this all over my face using my hands to distribute the product. I'm going to be using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Orange Corrector and placing this on the areas that I have dark spots or circles. using my Morphe Full Coverage Foundation in F340 and I'm going to be using the same beauty blender that I use to blend out my concealer. Concealer from Morphe. This one is in C325. To set my concealer, I am using the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder and I'm just using a fluff brush and just applying it to the areas that I have put concealer. That way, my concealer stays on all day and there is no creasing. She loves me as she needs to know. the rest of my face I'm using Morphe's filter effect finishing powder and filter number seven I'm using Max Patrick star bronzing powder and give me life with an angle brush and I'm just applying this to the hollows of my cheeks temples of my forehead and my jawline for blush, I'm using the MAC Mineralize Blush in Warm Soul and I'm just applying this to the apples of my cheeks. 
For highlight, I'm using Max Mara Line Skin Finish in Soft and Gentle, applying this to the highest point of my cheekbones, down to the bridge of my nose, and also cupid bow. For brows, I'm using the LA Girl Brow Pomade in a soft brown, and I'm using this on an angled brush to achieve my snatched brows. Since the brows are done, we're gonna go ahead and do our waterline. So this is the Morphe Dark Room Color Pencil. Super glidable. I love this pencil so much and it's so so black. So I'm just applying it to the waterline, the bottom lower line of my lash because we're going to be applying some shadow down there. Going back to the palette, I'm taking the color Brilliance which is a dark brown color and I'm going to be smudging this under my lash line. Using the same pencil brush, I'm going to be taking the color Sleek and I'm going to be putting this onto the bottom of my lash line together with the color Brilliance. Then I'm using a clean fluff brush to just diffuse the harshness because we don't want harsh underneath our eyes. I'm taking Expressive and this is kind of like a vanilla kind of type of color and I'm putting this in the inner tear duct. forget to curl both of your lashes and then for mascara I'm using the L'Oreal Paris voluminous waterproof mascara in black Lashes. I am going to be using the Simu Hawaii Lash Bar Lashes in a Lemon Drop and this is owned by one of my good friends and I'll link her website of her lashes down below in the description box. I have a discount code for you guys and it's called Beauty by Brandy. It will save you 15% off your entire purchase. lip liner I'm using max plum lip pencil and for lipstick I'm using hug me by Mac and that completes this final look hope you guys really enjoy this video leave your comments down below on what video you guys want to see next and everything will be listed down in the description box for you to find out what products I use don't forget to check out my friends a lash company also don't forget to show her some love also if you do ever purchase her merchandise again thank you so so much and I'll see you guys in the next video